Hi everyone. Um, I thought since it's such a yucky winter morning, I would do a little chat to you about cloth diapers. Now I've used cloth diapers for both of my babies, uh, C and now B. Uh, they've both been cloth diapered since birth. Um, C has been in disposables, B has never been in disposables. So the four main cloth diapers I use are pretties and this pretty is an all-in-one which means it's got nothing snapped in, nothing stuffed, just whack it on the ground, put your baby in it, both my babies scream so I'm using a doll, <laughs> put your baby in it, snap them in and voila pretty bum especially when they're crawling or walking oh, so cute um bernadette is now crawling and walking so it's really cute putting her on a fluffy when the heat pumps on okay when it's pooey or wet you take it off put it aside scrape the poo off into the toilet um, I usually use a bit of toilet paper and just peel it off and then you rinse it in your laundry sink pop it in your wash and that's it for all in ones which is really handy the next one is probably one of my favorites I've actually brought my two favorites in for you to see it is what are you <laughs> an eco tots it's stuffed with bamboo so that's it there two bamboo liners and an outer layer which is waterproof so you pop it in the back here make sure they're lying nice and flat and to the edge because otherwise you get leaky sides and that's always a pain because then your diaper's dry but your baby is not <laughs> um, so that's it all stuffed lie it down put dolly on it this is going to be huge on dolly i should have snapped it smaller so these ones you can use the front domes to snap them smaller i never did because i had newborn sized diapers for b when she was really little actually not really little she was still in newborn sized diapers like two months ago and then you use the velcro hit the front to snap her in and there's dolly in the newborn diaper it's important to make sure with these ones especially that it's nice and tight around the legs because otherwise you do get the leaky and then when baby does poo a wheeze it's the same deal you scrape the poo off and then you rinse but always rinse with cold water because hot water will leave the stain in and once you've rinsed you need to take your liners out to wash them and I always unsnap the front as well next one itty bitties you'll notice these are a bit smaller uh, this is a medium itty bitty it's a snapping one so it has two liners too but it has a bit different it's a bit different this is a tri-fold liner it's second hand so it's a bit wary all of my diapers are second hand so you fold it in in and then you snap it onto the blue domes it's got a matching colour on the trifle. Hi V. You don't need a diaper change. No. And then another liner on top. And you can put a booster on the red domes. But um, I only ever do that at night time. So then you snap it onto the yellow domes. Someone's off to see what her brother's up to. And then it's ready for baby. So you lie baby on the diaper, same as, same as. And this one has kind of a different snap at the front, sorry baby. So that you can do it tighter depending on how big your baby is. So snap, 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 snap. Be careful going up those stairs, B. And there we go. So those are the itty bitties. Now, for these, 
same deal scrape off the poo rinse it and then unclip it and put it in the washing machine i'm not going to unclip this one <laughs> because it doesn't need washing and now for my least favorites my emergency diaper so it's been raining for about mm, two weeks straight <laughs> it's the middle of winter and i no longer have a dryer so everything is getting dried on the inside clothes horses um nothing is getting dry on the outside line because there is still a full load of washing on there from three weeks ago <laughs> um <laughs> With no dryer, it means I have to be really careful about how I'm drying everything at the moment. Which means I have been using my emergency diapers. Because before, all that went on that clothes horse inside were my cloth diapers. It meant that I stayed on top of my cloth and everything. Now everything's going on there and I don't have enough room for it all. So. <sighs> we have an old fashioned flat we've folded it up and chucked it in there this is just a cover homemade um second hand but homemade it's got velcro not very adjustable not very strong probably not good for a summer spear but it's good enough for a spear you put baby on your diaper fold it up pop it in uh, and the problem of course is that poor baby does not have a big enough waist and then she's alright she's jammed her fingers on the door not badly she's just giving herself right the problem with these is that you need a waterproof cover over top because otherwise you just pee right through them and it's the same deal as all the other ones of course you scrape off the poo and then pop it in the wash um i might do a separate video on washing instructions but that's the introduction to cloth diapers of course there's lots of different brands worldwide these are just the ones that i use um these aren't even all the ones i use because i brought all mine second hand i have so many so many um but yeah i will do another video on washing instructions god bless